Iron Warriors 4 just released their Gear 5 Luffy DLC, and you know I had to be a part of this. So I jumped straight into the game, and then I had a little bit of an issue, because I haven't actually beaten this game. I didn't even get past the Alabasta arc, so I'm going to be taking you on my journey through beating this game, and then unlocking all of my gear transformations, including Gear 5. So let's get into it with the Alabasta arc. He's so shit burning on Bro, why is he so weak? Bro, he's not really attacking. I'm just spamming buttons. Oh! He's halfway down. He has yet to even do anything to me. Oh my god, I'm hitting nothing. There we go. Uh-oh. That was only for phase one. Phase one crocodile honestly was kind of pathetic. He didn't even fight back. He kind of just took the beating. I then progressed through Alabasta a little bit more, doing the Zoro mission. And then we get to the real crocodile fight. Crocodile. Ha, ha, ha. Uh, let's power up and give him the beating of his life. Okay, don't miss. Bazooka! Ow! He actually is attacking back this time. Toss him! Toss him! Oh, now we're doing heavy damage. Finish him off with this! Bruh. Okay, I guess I have to finish him off with the bazooka. Or that. And GG's. Perfect ending. And that concludes Alabasta. We finished him off by doing our gum gum storm and throwing Crocodile through the roof. And now we start the Water 7 arc with Luffy versus Usopp. And we all know how that ends. And then we got Usopp versus Luchi. So I'm supposed to kill Luchi with fucking Usopp? Oh my god, one of his hits does a third of my health. No way he fell for it. He's asleep. Do it again. Take the barrel! Take the barrel! He jumped over it! He uses Devil Fruit. We might actually have this. Frankie, help! No, 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 no! He actually did it. Usopp solos. I somehow took down Luchi with Usopp, but I mean, it's not really taking him down. But then we go back into Luffy's POV as he unlocks Gear 2 against Bluno. Oh! Secondo. Captain! This is actually sick! And then hit him with the gat! I missed. There's a chest here? Meat! Like he gets his shield back and it's just gone. And then I hit him with one of these! And GG. Boom. We were also about to use gear 3 on him, but he just collapsed. We then burnt the flag down and also we got to see Zoro's Ashura. But now it was time to fight Luchi for real with Gear 2. Real quick though, I just want to remind you guys of the merch drop that dropped last week. If you want to pick up anything from my Rift in Time collection, link will be down in the description or at cloudclothing.ca. So yeah, go check them out. The designs are sick. Alright, now he's done. Bro, I had an easier time beating him with Usopp. Now I go Gear 2. Gear 3! Oh shit, I'm tired! <laughs> Help! I f***ed up by getting rid of my gear too so early. He's floating! I got this, I got this. Come on, just die already! He's dead! Back into gear two, and then just pummel him. I'll always love this scene. And that kind of concludes Water 7 and Eni's Lobby. And then we start the Saba Odi arc with fighting Kizuru. Rayleigh steps in. And then we start with the Summit War. I had decided to play as Daddy Whitebeard. And it was actually pretty fun. Just using the Quake abilities and stuff on everyone. It was awesome. We saw the Conqueror's Hockey for the first time. I got to fight Buddha Sengoku. Defeated him. Ace got saved, but that didn't last very long. And then we get into Dress Rosa. I also got to play as Sabo, which was also very fun. At this point, the game was growing on me a lot. I didn't really like the Summit War arc, to be honest, because it was so goddamn tedious. But Dress Rosa ended up probably being my favorite arc. We ended up getting to the end of Dress Rosa with the Dopey fight. Also, shout out to the members of the Cloud Discord, Alter and Shiro. They helped me a lot through this game. And also, join the Discord down below. There's two Dofies. And there's one pathetic Bellamy. Pounce on him! Bro, why is he kind of weak? Helicopter, helicopter, helicopter. 
Oh shit! Four! Oh shit! We're in gear four! Oh wow! It looks hella goofy! King Kong gun! I keep missing the bouncing noises! Here we go! I always like Dopey because he does have like theoretically one of the worst devil fruits, but he uses it in such a cool way. Oh my god, I'm just jumping in the air. <laughs> He's dead here. He's dead here. Alright, GG's. GG's. Easy fight. We ended up finishing off Dofi, and then we got to see the Sanji versus Luffy fight again. And then I sadly had to beat up the best girl in the series, Big Mom. It, it was a heartbreaking situation for me, to be honest. But it was nothing in comparison to the fight that was coming up next. No! That was an instant loss. We're Snake Man! It's so fast! What am I- Was I getting hit that in- what? What? What did I die to? No! I can't deal with this anymore. I have spent four hours of my life, four hours that I will never get back again. I will never live those four hours again. And I've sat here looking at this mid graphic shitty ass game to beat this stupid ass f boss, bro. All right, screw this. Bro, this fight has actually given me a whole lineup of, of mental illnesses. I spent six hours on Melania. This fight has almost taken me as long as Melania did, bro. This is it, dude. I don't even care. If I can't beat it in easy mode, I I'm, I'm giving up on this game. Come on. Stomp on him. He's dead here, right? Just f***ing die, man. Oh my god. Feeling absolutely mentally scarred from that Katakuri battle, but I got him. And now we start Wano. We get to meet Kaido for the first time. By the way, he looks sick in this game. I fought his base form, but then he ended up just yeeting kid. I then finished the Wano arc. Blackbeard show up. But now I finally had access to the free mode. Well, technically I had access to free mode a while ago, but I wanted to finish the game first so then I can go into whatever mission I wanted as Luffy. But with all the arcs being unlocked in free mode, it was finally time to use gear five. I'm about to wreck every- Oh shit, outfit on point. We have a normal Luffy as well here. I haven't even used a special yet, and I've already taken down all their health. This is sick. Oh, it's okay. This one's kind of shit. All right, all right. We'll wait. We'll wait for it to to be on on Luchi. What about this? What does this do, bro? I'm doing a cool move, you ass. Shut up. I'm dude. I'm being blue balled right now. Huh? It just took away my ability. It didn't even let me see it, bro. I'm pissed. Look at their health. Oh no, that's new. Red Rock. Yes. That's what- Oh my god, bro, my Switch can't even handle the animation. Alright, let's do it, Luchi. Oh, shit! It just has the Gear 2 animation? Hey, you know what? I'll take it. Oh, he's bouncing around! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! He walks so funny! Boing, boing. He doesn't have- Oh, no, he does have special moves. He does have special- <laughs> I love the way he walks. Oh, he can pick up lightning in this! That's Byrang! <laughs> it's through the roof. <laughs> Bro, how is Luchi surviving that? He's already transformed. Oh my god, I do so much damage. I love his little symbol in the bottom right. Or in the bottom left, sorry. It looks so cool. This might just be the recency bias, but I think this might be my favorite transformation of all time. Boom. Well, Luchi went down with no issue. Alright, let's see how fast Gear 5 can defeat a pacifista. Boing, boing. Oh my god, I can create literal tornadoes? Oh, that's so cool! I'm so free! Free from the shackles of this game's story mode. Ow! Oh my god, look how I run! I do the goofy run! Oh, I love that. Hey, Kobe. <laughs> Fire and gun him. It one tapped Kobe in the base game. It literally took me like three attempts just to beat him normally. Oh shit, you could charge it even more. I wonder if there's a way to go like big mode. Oh, there is. Now it's Red Rock him. 
Again! I'm getting cut by cutscenes! Mihawk. Oh, uh, dude, Gear 5 versus Mihawk. This is gonna be interesting. I'll even take- You know what? While I wait for Mihawk, let me just take on a Kainu real quick. Take this! You devil fruit relier! Man, I hate these stupid ass cutscenes. Giganto Pistoro! I just absolutely shredded a Kainu, bro. Mihawk isn't even here yet. Where's he at? Off we go! I'm coming, Mihawk! Let's do it! Is he already dead? Oh my god, he's halfway. Fire rang him and he's done. <laughs> Easy! Now we got the giant Buddha statue. I actually love this DLC, it's so much fun. More fun than the base game, I would say. Oh my god, it does so much damage. This boss literally took like five minutes of just straight punching. How come Byron Gun lags less than Red Ro- Oh my god, it actually one-tapped it. Now, boys, I think it's time to take this fucker into the guy that absolutely ruined my life for a day. Oh my god, we even have a summon? I never suffer- I haven't suffered since millennia as much when I fought you. Which is sad to say, this is a One Piece game. Give him a red rock. We don't need gear 4. We need gear 5! Are you fucking- Bro. I swear, if I'm not in gear 5 and my bars run out, I'm throwing my switch off of a skyscraper. Okay, thank god. Take my drums of liberation, you piece of shit! Take some lightning. Yeah, your dumbass mochi fruit can't shoot lightning. I bet it can't. But got him! Finish him off! Bro. Puffed again. And it removed the ability! Also, can I say, Snake Man is the worst transformation in this game, bro. Base Luffy is better than Snake Man. Snake Man was so ass. Okay, this better not cutscene me again, I swear to god. GG's, cat of shitty. Helicopter finish! Storm finish! Nope. Okay. PISTOL! How is he alive? How is he alive? This is killing him for sure. WHAT?! There we go. Alright, I think we finished this off on Onigashima. I think it's only right, you know? Can imagine being like one of these guys in the One Piece world? You're just kind of like, a, like an NPC. Like you're being- you're forced to, to battle the main characters and you think you're him. And then this just happens to you. Must be tough. Ah, uh, Big Mom. I'm sorry to do this to you. This is the, the, the best girl in One Piece. Too bad I have to destroy her. Let's see what Gear 5 can do against the big woman. That was a nice little combo. Ow, 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 ow. She actually hurts. Let's use Byrang. Byrang's gonna finish her. Homies possess Big Mom. Not my homies. And there she goes. <laughs> I love the running. It does surprisingly a lot of damage. Like, look at this. I'm just trucking through these guys. They should make a One Piece cart, and this should be one of the carts. I don't even need to use Gear 5 on some pathetic guy like you. Oh, shit. I'm going out of the map. Okay. I'm sending Hawkins into unexplored areas of Wano. What the? I don't think I'm supposed to be here. All right. We shall fight in the Flint, Michigan Lake. Okay, jump out. It's actually the... What the? Where does that come from? Honestly, out of all the worst generation, Drake is kind of the most irrelevant one. I'm not going to lie. He's just there. I don't... This is like the eighth time fighting him because he keeps defeating me. But this time, I've got something up my sleeve. Like a low frame red rock. Oh, shit. This will kill him right up his crotch. Oh, yeah. That's the way to attack a big, thick-skinned idiot like Kaido. Oh my god, I accidentally activated that. It's fine. It's not like he's gonna die anyways. It kind of works out perfectly in a way, you know? Oh, I actually don't do as much damage as I thought. He's kind of tanky, Jesus. He's still very tanky, but I think once we get the, his sh stupid shield out, we're good. Alright, Byron gun! Yes! Oh my god, it's so accurate. And then you see his little head there too? Oh, oh, oh. So yeah, in this game, it has a custom Wano ending, and the ending is pretty much everyone binds together and attacks Kaido. It's just like what the One Piece is, you know? The One Piece is the friends we made along the way. We don't have much time left in Gear 5, but we do have a fast way to get up to him. I still love that. Ah! 
I stopped the bl blast breath. I mean, to be fair, if, if he had killed Cavendish, I honestly would not have cared. It's Cavendish. Ow! Ah! Pete! Ah! Ah! Ooh, ah! Ah! Bro's been charging that blast breath up since the time skip. Jesus. All right, let's go gear five and then Goofy run to him. This is what this game is ma made for. There we go. We stopped that blast breath as well. It took him down. You know what that calls for? My ray gun! Oh my god, look how much damage that shit did. We might be able to finish him off with a fire ray gun here. Just keep laughing at him. I want to finish him with a fire ring. It has to be the perfect ending. It has to be. Or else it's a... No! Like this video for more One Piece games. Maybe we could do some One Piece related challenges.